Hey everyone, Chris here with Platinum Reviews and we have the newest edition of Platinum News. This is going to be for the week of 10-7 through 10-14. I, I like when weeks or months start like this because it uh, doesn't take a lot of math. Next week is going to be 10-14 to 10-21. So, you know, it doesn't take a lot of math to add 7 to 7. So, uh, thank you, month. Um, as always, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, check out our Facebook page for everything Platinum, all our news, reviews, everything. Go to Facebook and check it out. Pretty sweet stuff. Uh, now, this time of year is my second favorite time of the year when it comes to video games. First, of course, is E3, but second is the fall because everything is coming out. Uh, currently, I've been playing Shadow of War. Evil Within 2 just came out, so I've been playing that too. And then South Park The Fractured Butthole comes out on Tuesday. And uh, that's been my most anticipated game of the year. I, I, whew, I can't wait. Can't wait for South Park. Uh, so, pretty excited. Yes. And then Assassin's Creed's coming out. I mean, we just got game after game after game. So it's my second favorite time of year because you just have a lot of things that you can play. You can't really get bored during October and November. But that being said, let's go ahead and get into the news. Um, Cuphead has sold over 1 million copies for PC and Xbox. If you haven't had a chance to play it yet, I definitely recommend it. it Microsoft definitely has a gem there. I personally think it could be Microsoft or Xbox One's best game. Um, there hasn't been another game that's just been like, oh man, I, I would put it over Halo 5. So uh, yeah, I, I definitely think Cuphead's a really good game. So check it out. Uh, South Park The Fractured Butthole. Season Pass has been detailed by Ubisoft. For those that did not get the Gold Edition, this Season Pass costs $30.00. And it will include a combat challenge, Dr. Timothy's Danger Deck, a story expansion from Dusk Till Casa Bonita, and a new story and superhero class in Bring the Crunch. Epic Games has filed a lawsuit on alleged cheaters on Fortnite. Epic Games did warn that they would, take, they would not take cheating lightly, and as of this, they have sued the alleged cheaters on PC, PS4, and Xbox One. What do you think? Uh, is this too drastic or is it justice well served? Let me know in the com comments below. Also, Battle Royale mode has hit 10 million players in just two weeks. That's pretty impressive. Uh, now for some quick headlines. Mass Effect Andromeda is now on EA Access. Tekken 7 has passed... 2 million copies sold, and to meet demand, Nintendo is pushing Switch production to 2 million units produced a month. So you can get your hand on a Switch. Uh, games coming next week. We have Gran Turismo Sport, Sport, can't talk, Gran Turismo Sport for PS4, NBA 2K18 and Fire Emblem Warriors for Nintendo Switch, WWE 2K18 and South Park the Fractured Butthole coming out for Xbox, PS4. I think both of them are coming to PC. Don't know about wrestling. Maybe. Yeah. Um, as always, for all your video game news and reviews, stick to Platinum Reviews. And you guys have a great rest of your day. Catch you next week.